So guys, in this video, I'll actually be showing you how to make your very own piggy bots, including the jump scare camera and all of that inside of this video, okay? And what I've actually done is I've created my very own model for you guys to use, and it, it'll be in the description, so you can actually grab it. It has everything you need. I'm going to be showing you how to animate all three of these. Um, so they're not they're not going to be different. This isn't going to be like the normal bot. This isn't going to be like the wandering one. This isn't going to be the one that sees you and chases you. This is just free bots I'm going to create and then I'm going to show you how to do it just so you guys know what to do, okay? And everything that you're going to need is actually inside of this model, okay? All three piggies, skins, and then we've got the other things and that, the animates and the sounds, okay? And what first thing we're going to do is I'm going to do, going to just ungroup this, okay? So that everything is inside of your workspace, okay? And then you'll see that it says remote events. It'll probably say on yours replicated storage. You want to actually drag this into replicated storage, okay? Drag it into replicated storage, don't have to do anything else with it then. Grab the visible players, okay, grab visible players and then take this down to starter player, put it in there and then put it in starter player scripts, okay? You can leave that there as well. Um, you also want to take screen GUI and put this into starter GUI, okay, which is down here. Once you've done that, that will be everything that you need to do there. Now all we're going to do now is just add to the skins, okay? First thing we're going to do is we're going to do pony. We'll do pony first, okay? So you'll see that he's got nothing at the moment. If we play it, literally nothing will happen. And all we're going to do first... So I'm going to open up Pony, and what we're going to do is we're going to take out Pony's hit jump scare theme, okay? And we can see that we've also got Pony's animate, okay? We want to put Pony's animate into Pony, okay? That will be his full animations if you go into animation editor and do this. This will be his full animations. You've got the killing one. You've then got the idle one, which are all really, 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 really accurate. I've created myself, and then we're going to do running or walking even. You see that they're the exact animations, okay? And what we're going to do next, so once it's put animated in, you don't need to do anything else with that, then all the animators are already in there for ready, ready for you. You're going to get chase, chase script, okay? And you want to put take, take chase script, and you want to just copy it, because you want to use it multiple times. And you want to do control, shift, and V, and post it into, paste it into Pony, okay? That one you want to leave there. That's a script that will chase the bot. If you want to change the search distance, um... Then you can do that, I guess. I've met, I guess that's really how you do the outfits and that. You just do like the, they only detect you about that. But then again, it makes it a bit difficult if you're in another room and they see you, which I don't. So, I mean, I don't know how he does it, but um, what we're going to do now is we're going to grab kill script. And we're going to put kill script into the humanoid root park and you're going to leave that in there. So you're going to put that into the kill script, into the humanoid root park. This is what's going to kill the player when they touch them, okay? What you're then going to do is you're going to take pony's theme. Pony jump scare and ponies hit, and you're gonna put all of these into humanoid root part, okay? You want to rename pony hit, rename pony hit hit sound. You want to rename pony jump scare ambience a m b i e n c e, and you want to name ponies theme. Um, what did you, what did you name this one again? Oh no, pony theme ambience even, and then put jump scare jump scare so once you've done that now what you're going to do is so you, you've got this name hit sound jump scare and you've got a kill script underneath it okay you want to go outside this again and you want to look for the animation we actually want to close down pony now and you'll see it says pony kill you want to just drag that straight into pony and then you want to name it swing with a capital s make sure it's capital s and then once you've got that that's pretty much your skin done if you want to change the um, ambience, you want to change it to being like 40 is what I had it on, and then inverse tapered, and then it'll be. I want it in that, and then I'm, um, what you'll do then is all the scripting is done for you. You don't need to do anything else. And now, what you're going to do is just click play. I'm going to click play, and then Pony should hopefully chase you, and then everything from then should go well. Oh, oh. Let's just stop that a second. We're gonna tell before you test it. If you want to test it before, make sure you turn down the themes to not playing while you're not in them. When you go into them, obviously make sure they're playing. Otherwise, you can have them playing in the background as well while you're trying to test the other ones. So now you'll see that ponies is there and he starts chasing you like he should. He'll follow wherever you go. It will only chase the nearest one, so it won't chase like the you like the one player for the whole game. It'll only chase the nearest player. And then you'll see that you can hear his theme in there. Walk further away from him. 
You can't hear his theme. You walk up to him in it and then you can hit him. Get the jump scare camera and it all works in that. It's perfectly fine, then you can respawn again. In a second there you go, and then he'll be right over there. And he'll come back for you, see, because his, his search distance is a 10,000 I believe, so he'll pretty much see you throughout the entire base plate at least. You'll see that it works quite well. There's a better picture there because he went down with it. He might kill you multiple times, that's alright, that's just because he touched you him in a root part again. Now what we're going to do is we're pretty much going to do the same thing for Doggy and the same thing for Alpha Scan. We're going to do, we're going to, we'll do it with you, okay? You're going to take the chase script and you're going to just go Control C. And then you're going to go into Doggy, go Control Shift V. That's going to stay in there. And also I forgot to copy Pony's kill script. So you're going to take the kill script again, go Control C, go into Doggy, and then go into his human root part, Control Shift V. Okay, and then what you're going to do is you're going to take Doggy's animate and put that into there. You can take all three of Doggy's themes and that and you can put that into the human root part and make sure they're all named correctly which is going to be ambience on the theme jump scare will be jump scare and then hit will be oh I forgot to specify this you've got to make sure it's a capital H and a capital S in hit sound okay and then a capital J obviously and once you've done that's pretty much doggy's done as well I actually think um oh wait we've got to do his animation so go down and grab doggy kill Put it into doggy remodel and then or whatever it is. You might be using your own skins. You can use your own skins for this as well. We've got to do is add you add whatever it is in. To change it to be swing and then we can test it, okay? Pony will obviously follow us for this, so we're gonna just make sure we're only getting doggy. You'll see that doggy will follow us with the correct animations, you see that? And I've also turned his theme of playing, so we're gonna <laughs> That is one problem. They, if they clash, they will kill each other. But they're not meant, there's not meant to be multiple bots on the map. So we'll just put the pony over there for a second. Then we'll go back into his ambience and we'll turn it up to 40. And then playing on. And then we'll do, click play again. And then you'll see. It will play while you load into the game. Only on the test version though. But then you'll see that he's chasing you. This is what it's meant to be doing, and then we've run into him. Works perfectly. And where's dog? Where's doggy gone again? There he is. It's per perfect. It's really, 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 really simple as well. There's not too much to worry about, especially with this model that I made for you guys. If you go into Alphys now, we'll do Alphys's and then we can end the video. So if we go into Alphys now, take out Alphys animate, put that into Alphys, chase script, put that into Alphys, and then take the kill that we actually didn't copy again. Put that into his human or root part. And then take Alphys beam, Alphys jump screen, Alphys hit, and put that into his human or root part. Rename them so you now want to name it so it's hit sound. And then you want to do jump scare. And you want to do ambience, which is going to be A, M, B, O, A. You want to make sure they all start with the capitals as well. Ambience. So we go. And then all you want to do is, I'm just going to make sure I'm not on mute, otherwise that would have been bad. Um, all you got to do then is take his kill, which is going to be Alphys kill. Blend to Alphys. Change this one to be swing. You can do this with any piggy character. I've tested on a lot of them so far and they all work perfectly fine. Um, and then all you're going to do is take the, um, what was the last thing i got to do? Oh yeah, change his theme, um, which is going to be in human or root part, ambience, 40, and then playing, and then we'll contest this now, so that should all be done, dogging out won't, won't be able to bother us. You're going to need to chase us with the correct animations. There you go, see? Well, that's the front. Love this theme. Uh, where's Alpha Spawn? There he is. And you'll see that if you run into him. Oh, perfectly fine. All good. Um, One other thing I would like to say. The. 
animations. If you have your own animation. So if you have your own animations, all you're going to do is click Animation Editor. Oops, we're on Pony Baxon. And then we're going to click over to Alphys. And you'll see this is striking. That's a funny position to have him in. We just go Import, because I have a lot of these on here already. So I'm going to just import one. Um, I will do... Um, I'll do Ghosties, okay? And all you're going to do is just submit that. And then you'll see... Yes, it's only just a slap because it's the wrong arm. All you want to do then is you click these three dots and then click Export. And you name it whatever you want to name. You can just spam some. I normally just spam the keyboard in the description. And all you do is click submit. Take this little link here. So you're going to take this link and copy it. And then you want to just go into his swing. And then you see these digits here. You just want to cancel them out and then just paste in a new one, which is like that. And then that will give him the new animation. That's all you do to change the animations. Themes is the exact same. You just add his theme and then put them in. Uh, and the swing and kit, swing and chase script is the same. So what we're going to do. And then hopefully this um, should be working good, you see. See, looks perfectly fine. So, that is actually how to make a really, 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 really simple bot with the jump scare camera. Um, if you did enjoy that, guys, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to never miss another video. And I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.